Okay, Debbie. You got this. Speaking of saving the world, I guess we should probably get around to that. Yeah, I mean, Narnia time is, you know, gives us a little bit of leeway, but I kind of run out of things to do. Really? I mean, we, we can't go and, and talk to, like, the CBC lady again? She was nice. She was nice. I just have, like, a really weird feeling that if she ever took that, like, if she ever took off the helmet, She'd spill out. Oh, God. I... No. No, not even thinking about that. She is a very nice woman, and she should never find out about 2016. Or later. Yeah. I keep thinking of, like, if I saw inside there that helmet, it'd be like, Hey, who turned off the lights? I think that shit we went through is kind of getting to you. Maybe. You can't give up on them, okay? We, we gotta do this for them. Okay, so like... This was easier before. Yeah, what... What the hell? Uh... I don't know, I mean, maybe like your bees... Mad at you. Or something like you know, like your like you know, you, you, your your parents get angry. They're like, okay, we're taking away your car. You know, maybe like the bees angry, and they're like, okay, we're taking away your superpowers. Well, I mean, I still have them. They're just like not working as well as they. Sh they're like, I don't know. It's like it doesn't feel right. I don't know either. I'm feeling this weird sense, and I think you might be exactly right. I'm feeling this, like, sense of hostility. Wow, really? Yeah. Not like, it's not my normal self-hatred. I know what that feels like. This is more, like, in the back of my head, like, sort of like an eyes on the back of your head feeling. Yeah. Can oh, you... right. I can teleport. I was I was not going to mention it. I feel like we were having a moment there. So, back to Kingsmith, all right. <laughs> yep, back to Kingsmith. Man. Um. What, did it not work? It. Let me try again. No, we I almost got it. Come on, bees. Third time's a charm. Don't okay. have time for this shit. It'll save the world here, bees. Thank you. Yeah. Whew. So, over here is where the first ward is. Hmm. I wonder where. Do you think it could be the pillar of glowing light? Could be, could be. Hm. Wait a minute, I know this place. Oh yeah, we, we saw this once before. Yeah, and we were like wondering the, why it was already glowing. What? That's interesting. Hey, when mystery solved, mystery solved. Oh wow, we can actually solve a, th a thing. It was glowing. Because of, of Viking magic. There we go. Do you think it's like always glowing and people around here are just like, oh yeah, that's glowing rock, you know, it's it's cool. But I mean, have you seen these new smartphones? I don't think it started glowing until stuff happened. Until like stuff went down here, probably. Eh, yeah, that would make more sense. Well, it's half an altar. That works. So it's only a half true. Ha, uh, so it's only a ha altar. 
So it's only a half tur. You tried. Shut up. Ah, <sighs> so I just. So I took my blood. I cut the back of my hand. Oh, it still needs my blood. It needs more blood. Good. Oh, zombie! Wait, what? There's like other zombies too. Zombies are helping me? Oh, cool. The Viking zombies are helping me. Um, whose side are these Viking zombies on? I can't even keep it straight. Good. Okay. Gotta protect. Draugr coming in. I think that we poked a hornet's nest here. So, I mean, these are technically, though, like, the Viking zombies fighting Viking who turned into Draug. Yep. It's like, he, it's like Gus fighting, you know. Zombies turn... I, I was going somewhere with that. Filth people. Filth people. There we go. Who is Gus? Jesus, how are these many... How many waves of these guys are coming? I mean, if I know my Nintendo... I think we're going to be facing a boss monster soon. What, what was that about Gus, though? You mentioned someone named Gus. Gus? Yeah, you said, like, like Gus, and then filth monsters. I said, no, like us! Oh, like us, okay. Yes, like Gus. Filth monsters like Gus. Well, I don't know. We met a lot of people. We could have met a Gus. <sighs> Gus, don't be a filth monster. <laughs> <laughs> Gus, don't be a jumping puzzle in an MMO. Oh, jeez. Those are the worst. They are. Oh, see... Whoa, that sounded big. Yeah. Oh, there we go. There we go. See, now there was one more wave before the boss monster. Oh, wow. Well. It worked. All right, awesome. Okay. Now it's glowing red. Oh wow, yeah, that's bad. Must be my blood. I mean, I, I guess it's probably good then. Yeah. Normally, you think things glowing red less than good. Okay. Time to savage coast. Okay. Bees. Bees. Bees be nice. Well, here again. This place. This place. Yep. I don't like having my emotions drained. I barely have them to begin with. Come on. It's not fun. Actually, I have them pretty intensely, which is part of the problem. A little too intense sometimes. So wait, do you have them or do you not have them? I don't know. It depends on whether you ask me if I'm in an emotion draining area or not. That is... okay, fair enough. I'm gonna go see what that guy, the collector up there is all about. I remember him being mentioned before. Yeah. You know, I've always wanted to meet Benicio Del Toro. Hmm. <laughs> Don't think this, that's the same collector. This one, I remember being men the bees mentioning the collector in the same context as Henderson. Oh. Well, we should probably go kill him then. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, it's a scarecrow. Bam. Okay. Well, apparently you're you're, yeah, appara you're still able to kill some shit. Yeah. Oh, jeez. What am I gonna do if I'm facing Loki like this? And you just gotta get back in the bees' good graces, you know. Give leave, leave him like a big thing of pollen. The league gathered improvised weapons, slingshots, wooden stakes, firecrackers, and set out to earn their name. It was still a game until the Wendigo attacked. All their meat would have been food for a monster's belly, except for the secret abilities of one of the boys. Jackson Miller, 15 years old, broke all his oaths as a student of Innsmouth Academy by using magic off campus and among civilians. Panicking, he released lethal energies upon the beast. Seat. In the confusion, yeah. screams and firecracker smoke. The other boys did not see what occurred. So that's how they did it. Wait, yeah, I already knew that. Did we? They mentioned that vaguely in the, um, in the, um, in the, uh, it was with the Academy vaguely mentioned it. Okay, yeah. They they kind of, but you know, it's good to get confirmation. Yeah. It's hard to keep track. Thanks for cross referencing bees. Yeah, it's <laughs> the bees need a wiki. It's hard to keep track of what secret information we do and don't know. You know, especially since I sometimes know stuff that I don't know yet, and especially since like I think a lot of it, you know, is like the stuff we think we know. Maybe we don't know, or we don't have, like, the full picture yet? Yeah. Okay, where is this place? Is I it... should have just teleported again. Yeah. Well, it's good to get, like, you know... Well, actually, this is about... It's about just as far from the teleport site, so no. Oh, man, that is that is super inconvenient. This place feel kind of different now? What do you mean? I don't know. I mean, maybe after going through, you know... All that in, like, Town of the Freeborn's place. Or wherever the hell we were. I don't know, it just feels like... Less of a shithole, maybe. You know? Maybe. It's like now it's something we really gotta protect. Yeah, because I know that, like, no one else will. And... Mm -hmm. I don't even know if I can save this for real. Like, this is going to be... Like, whatever I do, they're probably still infected. Mm. I don't have to save it forever. I only have to save it today. It's, it's really good. It's really poetic. I got it from a video game. Of course you did. Of course you fucking did. About fairies. Okay, that one, that's a little surprising. Shut up. I'm just... I just didn't know that. I did not... I'm not a furry. Of course you're not. <sighs> familiars, of course. Good to know that the familiars were actually under their control. That's good. We gotta tie that loose end up. Yep. So I guess that it probably was, you know, Loki who made the whole familiar the familiars go berserk. It's just like at the end of a bad TV season where they try to be like, oh, the big bad's like, oh yes, all those random monsters throughout the, throughout the year, those were all me. Sometimes I think they're just taking credit. Like, yeah, I mean, who, who else is going to do it? You know? The other monsters are like dead. Like, they... It wasn't them. They know it wasn't them. But they're just gonna say it's them, because... It raises their profile. You know, it's all about looking good for the... For, for the Guild of Calamitous Intent. Oh, shit. <sighs> Fucking... A cob! Fucking a cob! As you see, this, I'm not, this isn't like a pleasant surprise. It's nice to know that these are the servants of some greater evil. I feel vindicated. I don't know if they're actually servants, though. These these don't seem to be for any particular, like, brood. 
That's interesting. Hmm. Free range. Or maybe, like, maybe he'd been breeding them? Ooh. Ugh. Oh, God, no. No. Don't want to think about any of that. Yeah, let's just focus on the familiars. Hey, yeah, these guys. These just... guys are freaky as fuck. Yeah, let's focus on... I, their screams are just so fucked up. Yeah. And I never thought we'd be siding with the zombies. I never thought... I die fighting alongside a zombie. <laughs> well, how about side by side with a thrall that you just happen to need? I mean, yeah, I, I, I don't think we didn't can, quite work there. I don't think we could call them friends. No, <laughs> we are certainly on the same side. That is all that can be said. Nope, not over. More fucking a cob! Oh, damn a cob! Just get, get a hobby oh, other than us. Don't destroy the stone. Get off of there. We need those. Get away from there! Get away from there, you bitch! Can you heal the stone? Can I heal a stone? I don't know. I don't... I probably can if I knew healing. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Coming right for it. No, get away from there. Get lured away. Somehow. Sorry, got filth on it, so I just have to be it before the before the filth got it. There. Okay, see that raises a lot of other questions, like how can filth infect a stone? Oh. Well, oh, no. I don't like the sound of that. What if it... Oh, no. Stop saying oh, no! What if it can affect stone? How? What if it's not a virus like we would understand it? Or a virus or a toxin like we would understand it? W what are you saying? You know what a prion is? Vaguely? I'm guessing it's some kind of particle. Yeah. It's sort of like a malformed protein that it gets in it, it gets in like your brain and it starts converting like brain cells into more of itself. It's not even a virus, it just is a thing that when it touches other proteins, it causes a reaction that converts those proteins into more of itself, particularly like the sheath around neurons. Uh huh. Well, what if it's just like that? It was just like a molecule that converts other molecules into itself. What if there is no will to it? What if it's just? I don't even know. I don't even know how to process that. What if it can affect like literally any physical thing? <laughs> 